Hello everyone. I'm Ricky. I'm a musician and a composer and I can't explain how excited I am to be here at the launch of the global standard for safe listening devices. Ladies and gentlemen, Not this is Ricky K. Grammy Award winner, Ricky Cash, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Keith. The evidence shows that around the world, more than a billion young people are at risk of hearing loss because of the way they listen to music. By listening to music too loud for too long, they're unintentionally putting their hearing at risk just by enjoying one of life's simple pleasures. standard where youths are able to be aware of the risk that they're entering into by listening to their devices too loud for too long. WHO has been working with the International Telecommunications Union and experts in audiology, acoustics and technology to develop a global standard for safe listening devices and systems. The standard makes evidence-based recommendations for safe listening features that should be included on every personal listening device like a smartphone or MP3 player. For example, the standard recommends that all devices have a dosimeter so the listener can see exactly how much sound they're getting. We also recommend volume limits, parental control options, and personalized safe listening messages. <laughs> <laughs> 